What's the deal, family? Welcome back to the Real Attraction Channel on YouTube. It's your boy Sean, and we here with another banger for y'all, man. So look, Dave LeDuc, or Leduc, LeDuc, I'm not sure exactly how you saying his name, man. King of Left Away Highlights, all right, man? This was sent to me on Instagram, at Sean W. Tyler. Get at me over there with any requests, any videos you want, man. Um... But look, man, I did a reaction to Lethaway. Somebody asked me for it. You know, I thought it would be interesting. I like combat sports. So I reacted to, um, like, an intro, like, documentary. The most, uh, Myanmar's Lethaway, the most brutal combat sport in the world, man. So go check that out if you want, if you don't know anything about the sport. Um, and then we also got Dave LeDuc, if you don't know who he is, man. Canadian. Damn, his birthday's a day before mine. Canadian Lethaway fighter. Who competes in the World Lethway Championship where he is the current WLC Cruiserweight World Champion. He is also the undefeated Openweight Lethway World Champion under traditional rules. Um, they changed the rules in the championship. So you got traditional rules, regular rules. Traditional is a little bit more violent, a little bit more bar, a little bit more archaic. And then you got the championship rules, which is a little bit more sanctioned, regulated, um, and mainstream, I guess you could say. And there's a divide between the two sports. But... He apparently is killing it in both traditional and modern rules, so it don't even matter. Um, let it gain, Ledoux gained widespread notoriety by becoming the first Canadian to win in the controversial prison fight. I gotta figure out what that is. Um, in 2016, he traveled to Myanmar to achieve his dreams, his dream of fighting Burmese bare knuckle boxing, considered the most, the world's most brutal sport. Uh, Ledoux challenged and defeated Tum Tum Min who was uh, then recognized as the best in the world and became the first non-Burmese to win a Lethway Golden Belt. Wow. The same year he married a mother man. Okay, all right, all right. Get, get some girls real quick. All right. Burmese wins. Okay, all right. 30 million viewers. Damn. Bro, famous over there. Famous, famous over there. All right, let's run this up. See what he's talking about, man. If you guys want me to react to more Lethway, like some knockouts, some headbutts, um, some other fighters, 10, 10, 10, 10, mean, whoever it is, let me know in the comments, get at me on Instagram. For the king of Lentway, the Nomad, Dave Latou. Elbows, head butts, and unconscious bodies. Lethway. Oof. Spin elbow. Is that a coconut? Bruh, tripping. here taking down plants trees bushes headbutts elbows all types all types of whatever whatever is necessary to get the job done that's how they gotta train i guess training the elements i'll get that neck right i guess <laughs> Oh, that headbutt, he used it. Ooh. 
Oh, what a double tap! I wonder like how I wonder how well like Muay Thai transfers into this like if you already been doing Muay Thai your whole life right you decide to do left way like how easy would that of a transition that would be or if it's a lot tougher than you would expect I'm curious about I'm really curious about that one Body shots was crazy. Big knees, big knees. That boy is covered. For those who don't know, you gotta literally knock your your opponent like unconscious type shit. Like, you know what I'm saying? At least in traditional rules, you gotta lock him out like unconscious. He's just trying to survive. What? Boop. Yeah, the boy about to work you. Good knee. Broke right through the defense. Oh, he leaking. He leaking, leaking. He hit him in the temple right there. Gone. Bro, he's also got a lot of height on almost. I don't, I don't think he's, I don't think there's one person that's been taller than him. At all. He ain't the biggest dude. He kind of smaller frame, but and I, a single person I've seen has been taller than him. So I know that height advantage is crazy, especially for them elbows too. And kicks. This dude looking reckless. Got him looking like a rag doll right there, man. to go swinging with the long arms but then turn those long swings into rotating elbows is like I noticed that but he can turn a straight shot into an elbow into an elbow he literally sometimes he's going for the shot and sometimes they curve into an elbow so you don't even really know what's gonna come to you low-key and I think that's where his hands his ability to use his hands and change exactly what he wants to do with them so quickly I see it's definitely a major major advantage that other cats is not necessarily doing like he is Respect, respect, respect. 
respect. Lethway, man. Hey, his hand speed is crazy. His hand speed, his ability to change whatever he's doing with his hands and his arms is good. And he, I mean, and he got the reach, bro. He got the leg and the arm reach, bro. Everybody there was way smaller than him. Like, it's tough. What you gonna do? He knows your sport and he got the size advantage, man. So, it is what it is, man. Let me know if you guys want me to do some more Lethway stuff. Hit that like button, subscribe, all that, man. I love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Keep it real, real, real. All boys reaches everyone. I'm going to see y'all next time. Peace.